Hello and thank you for tuning in. Today I will be showing you how I installed the LEDs we unboxed earlier. Let's dive into it. I screwed the two spotlights on this front plate and also had the clear flashing LED above the spotlights. Hear the wind, crying out its prayer. I placed one of the green flashing LEDs on this bull bar and another on on the other side. One of the blue flashing LEDs was installed here running round the passenger footrest and another was installed on the other side too. On the number plate, I installed the clear flashing LED, similar to the one on the front plate. Let's get into how I wired this LEDs to their respective switches. I will first explain using this illustration of a simple circuit diagram. Ok, here is the setup. We have the back of the motorbike and the front. This is therefore the back LED, these are the blue LEDs at the back, then this is the front LED, the clear one and the two blue flashing spotlights. These are the green LEDs at the front bull bar. We then have one switch here and another one here the battery here plus the fuse. Let's talk simple physics now. This switch, turns on the blue LEDs, the back LED, front LED and the green LEDs while this switch turns on the two spotlights. Let's start with the connection of the two spotlights. From the battery we have the positive line running through this fuse, then the connection is cut here where we have the switch for the spotlights. Then the negative terminal is connected to the two spotlights at this point. So when this switch is turned on, regardless of whether this other switch is on or not, the two spotlights will go on. For the other LEDs, the back LED is connected to the positive and negative line on this wire, the two blue LEDs are also connected on the same line here. The front LED is connected to the negative line here which links up to the negative line running from the negative terminal of the battery. The positive terminal for this LED is connected to the other positive terminals of this green LEDs and they all then connect to this positive terminal. For all the LEDs to receive the positive charge from the battery, the switch has to be turned on. The current then flows to the front LED which is interconnected with the green LEDs and to the back LEDs. The negative charge is connected here for all the front LEDs while the back LEDs pick the negative charge at this point and at this point. So when this switch is turned on, the front clear LED, the green flashing LEDs, the blue flashing LEDs and the back clear LED on the number plate will go on. Ok. That's the little physics behind the glitter and glamour of this bike. This switch powers on all the LEDs except this front spotlights which are powered on by this switch. Okay, let me light them up. That's it for now. Leave me a comment in the comments section below. Like and share my videos with friends and don't forget to subscribe. Don't look behind your back. Chase a light when the world is getting darker. I have a dream where love's the only side. So take my hand, join the army of the sun.